biomass resource assessment team here at Oak Ridge National Lab in the 2016 billion ton report evaluates currently used biomass resources, currently available biomass resources, and potentially available biomass resources in the future. So we estimate that there are about 350 million tons of currently used biomass resources for bioenergy and associated co-products. There's an opportunity to add over 400 million tons of biomass resources that are available today from waste resources, agricultural residues, and forest land resources. In the long term, there are another 400 million tons, up to maybe 700 million tons of energy crops that could be produced. So approximately doubling or tripling current uses of biomass energy to realize a total um, availability, a total use of upwards of a billion tons of biomass. There are factors that can increase the amount of biomass that's available and or reduce the amount of biomass available and or deliver biomass that's more valuable. So we try to account for these factors in our high yield scenario to simulate what, what gains could be made in the economic availability of biomass on the supply side, so that's our supply curve. In order to realize the production and harvest and delivery of these biomass resources, of course, we need markets. So any innovation across the supply chain on conversion or production or harvesting or logistics, any innovation that allows us to squeeze more profit out of a ton of biomass and can allow the market to use more and or pay more for biomass can shift the demand curve to the right, so basically increase uh, demand for our biomass resources. It's our hope that our resource analysis work can inform strategies and contribute to the realization of a billion ton bioeconomy vision.